Hey, welcome to a tampering guide video. Okay, this video is going to be on how to temper and how to temper for your specified class. Now I'm going to get into that in a second. You just claim a few more rewards here. Okay, now let's get into the video. So, temper. You need to look at what your class is specified in. So, naturally, I'm a, I'm a hunter, I'm a DPS hero or character, so I'm going to be putting all my points into agility, and that increases your attack damage and stuff. Okay. Tempering, like you did your attributes for, for your DPS character, or your warrior character, whatever you have. You're gonna, like, okay, I'm a hunter, I put everything in DPS, so I'm gonna naturally put this in the DPS. Attack, Impale, Tenacity, stuff like that, I mean, crit as well, yeah, crit, attack, hit. You wanna make sure that your, your tempered stats give you additional attributes for your specified class if it doesn't then that's a waste of a little tempering bonus it's a it's a complete waste so if you if you don't have things that cooperate with your class you're just gonna be wasting your time trying to increase the level of it and spending all like 200,000 shells on just one thing trying to get it to legendary like <laughs> it's just not it's not gonna be fun especially when you're in battle and you're starting to realize oh wait a minute man I got all my stuff to really high level temper and everything but why am I not doing any better it's because everything's in the wrong spots <laughs> like I'm got a ton of block and on the a DPS here, like an assassin, and you're over here stacking like 80,000 block or something. Like, <laughs> won't even make sense at all. So, uh, that's what you want to do. You want to do it for your specified class. Don't go off the rails with that at all, because that that is very crucial for growing in strength. For you to keep your stats correct. And now also for over tempering. A lot of people like to over temper because they like to see that advanced and legendary thing. They they like they, they just like to see that they got their stuff to the max level. That's not the idea with tempering. It's not what you're supposed to do. How you're supposed to temper is you're supposed to keep your tempered items or stats and everything. At, like in each intermediate level, which one is it? I had all intermediate right here. Just want to keep that intermediate or just entering advanced because after that, you're just over tempering and you're spending way too much time on it and you're wasting a lot of money. Because once you enter advanced on your tempers, RNG is going to just completely flip from like. 70% of the time getting positives to 90% of the time getting negatives. That's going to be a huge issue now. Because now you're sitting here wasting a ton, a ton, and a ton of shells. Trying to get it to super high advance, trying to get to legendary. It's going to be a huge waste of time. Because as soon as you rank up, that the stuff that you just got to legendary is not going to be back to intermediate because when you rank up it's gonna basically add the it's gonna increase the amount of points you can put into it 
So, like, I have 206, like, for my impale, I have 206 out of 351. That 351 maybe go to, like, 600. And that intermediate will go down to, like, elementary level. And it's just not going to look like anything at all. So, you're going to be busy wasting your time on that, and that's not too smart. Oh, that helmet actually looks pretty cool. Okay. <laughs> but, uh, yeah. That's how you're so really supposed to temper. Please, I beg you, don't go too far with your tempering. Don't be super thirsty to see yourself get to advanced or legendary. Keep your stats at intermediate or just entering advanced. Because you're going to end up wasting a lot of time on it. And the shells you could invest it into something else to get stronger. You invested into that. And it was a waste of time. Because you only went up for like two points in your HP. Like, it's not going to be fun. And it's just, you're just going to be super confused on why you're failing. But uh, I'm going to do a special temper here. And I'm just going to see if any of these go to advance. If I can just get a lucky thing. And... Hey. That's pretty good. Yeah. I believe special temper is a guaranteed plus. Like, I, th I think it's guaranteed going to get you a lot of points from it. Because obviously, you know, you're using pearls. But <clears throat> I don't know if it's guaranteed or not. So I wouldn't recommend spamming that either. Don't do not do that. Uh, that's going to be it for the video. If you want any, for, any more like, info on tempering or anything else. Or you want to have other guide videos made. Uh, leave a comment down below if, any, if uh, you want a guide video on maybe the toys. Uh, I'll probably I'll probably do a video on that actually. I don't know. It's pretty self-explanatory. I mean, it's not that confusing, but I guess I guess I might make a, a guide video on that. Yeah. Uh, leave a like if you enjoyed. Subscribe. Uh, I'll know what you want to do. And uh, I'll see you in the next video.